Hello, one and Trilla Simon, welcome back to Hunt Survivor 4 as the People's Republic of China. We're gonna upgrade this fighter we have because it's uh, it's fine, but it could be better. We're gonna max out that engine and maybe get it a bit of range and reliability to make up for that. Tad more range? No, tad more reliability. Yeah, I like reliable fighters and I cannot lie. Those other fighters cannot deny that's going to cost us a lot of aluminium, rubber, and oil. Yay. I have already compensated for that. We should, in theory, be getting our supplies in now. Oh, do we need even more rubber? Did I not plan for the extra rubber needed? Okay. Uh, we will get extra rubber from you. And I've got too much aluminium. Right. In the meantime, the attacks are going okay. Um, apparently I need more aluminium. Funny that. In the meantime, I'm going to push against them. We are no longer sure what these units are. We have no intel on them. We're going to need to up our intel. Uh, that makes me sad. What about you? Attack back. Once you're done, we'll fold this unit. Uh, we now need more steel. Okay. Hopefully we can sort that ourselves in the near future. What I would like is the British Raj to retake all the land down here. We then take that, then we can take Siam, then we can take Singapore. We'd be in charge of rubber and we'd deprive the allies of a lot of rubber. That's one of the reasons I want them to desperately do this. We'll be in a really good place. Um, how's that attack going? And yes, I'm going to reassign you to here. So now you have 74, which means you have enough to cover the front line. Well, not the front line, sorry, the coastline. The front line is a completely different thing. Ooh, three military factories, you don't say. Okay, uh, we need more fighters. Uh, I don't think we really have many choices. Um, one of the things we do need is fighters. Then we need some form of close air support, hopefully. And then naval bombers. All that tech's going to need to be done, though. Uh, Soviet Union. Having issues with oil. How much oil can I get? I don't want to take it overseas because that will be frustrating. And rubber. Well, if you get me the resources you promised me, we should be fine. Okay. You'll get shot. You'll get murdered, but fine. Please tell me we're making those... Uh, ...pretty far away. I'm going to put one of them to the top. Put two of them to the top. Okay, yeah, it's spreading out down the coastline. Good. Really? More aluminium? Oh, hello. No, don't attack. Stay in the stay in the naval base. Defend the naval base. That's not your job. Landing craft. Excellent. We need that to be able to invade anyone. Uh, however, I think we will quickly make a detour to air and get ourselves first level naval bomber. Uh, I wouldn't, we're going to need the naval bomber.
There we go. That should be dealt with now. Right. What is this? Why is New Zealand here? Why do they have a port? Why are you not defending that port? God damn it. Okay, well, I guess someone's going to be fighting New Zealand relatively soon. And again, someone pulled away from this. What? Why is no one defending this? Seriously. Why are you transporting by sea? Don't do that! You're just dead. This is why units are dying. They're transporting via sea. Don't. Don't, don't do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh God. Hopefully this will help. They own the sea. This is just dead units. That's why we've been losing units so quickly. They're landing extra troops. Right, we kick them out. Uh, bring you back under the auspice of this army up here, and we'll give you a front line. So, full back line. Down here. There you go. Now, please tell me you're going to do something sensible. This is vaguely sensible. No one's traveling by sea, at least. That's all the oil we can drain from them. You're not giving us any oil. At least none's getting through. Okay. Night Vision 2. That's brilliant. Uh, and I think, actually, can we manage the manager of territories? I'm going to put you on the... Um, gentlest setting, because I actually just want your, your stuff. Like, I don't care about your manpower. So I want to lower your resistance growth, because what I want is your factories. Ah, but, mm, That's a tough choice. I don't want you to break the factories, and I can't police you right now, so I'm actually going to put you on the lowest. Right, research slot available. We've got night fighting. Gonna grab air. Grab the Q2. What now? More steel? We need more resources.
And I'm hoping the British Raj can just do a little bit more push, because I'm not going to attack yet. With a little bit more push, I can. I want them to hit Siam, ideally. Because cutting off the entire rub supply to the Allies, no more fighters. We've been entrenched here far too long. When will you capitulate, Queen China? Oh, you've already capitulated. Okay. Yeah, keep that up. We're due a lot of invasions. We'll probably want to build ourselves some uh, fortifications in future. We'll do a mini surround here. Hold them in place. How long are you going to take to surround? Uh, done. They're now surrounded. Let's hit them. Right, what's the unfulfilled import request? Soviet Union uh, suffering from oil. We've got extra. Uh, that's great. Uh, extra, extra dockyards. Uh, I think we'll get a little bit extra in convoys. And then probably push the. Since the heavy cruisers are only big guns, probably going to push the heavy cruisers a little bit. And that is going to mean... Oh, that's fine so far. Okay. I'm going to try and punch through up here and do a surround. See what we get. They're resisting. They're resisting quite well. They must be getting bonuses from somewhere. Okay, yeah, let's actually just stop that attack. Let's not go anywhere. Too clean. We'll keep them here. Right. Again, they're really holding us in place. Uh, okay, I need more oil. I don't really have any way of getting more oil. Oh, actually, a little bit there. A little bit from you. That's really scraping the bottom of the barrel, though. Speaking of people who've got scraping the bottom of the barrel, um, apparently United Kingdom. The population is... Uh, the conscription, sorry, is scraping the bottom of the barrel. Which means we're winning. Through attrition. Hello. Yeah, that's the point. You're going to land, then we murder you. Uh, you're still pushing forward slowly. Excellent. This little pocket isn't going to be quite as glorious as it was going to be. How we can use a distraction. Mm, anywhere else that we could do anything at? No. They've really reinforced this quite well. 
Except for there. Yoink. I think what we will do over here as well is there's no point me not defending my friend's territory. So we might as well come down here and help defend them. Because they're going to send me oil. Well, that's Afghanistan. It won't send me oil. Yeah, well. Might as well. A lot of air warfare going on. How are we doing? Uh, not great. Right, we did grab that. Ah, they're sending reinforcements in. Try and slow them down as best we can. I'm not sure we're going to get very far with this, but we can try. Uh... Aluminium. Yeah, you've got plenty of aluminium to give. That's one of the few things that the Soviet Union have just loads of available. Uh, excellent. We're pinning them down. Ah, they put reinforcements in. Um, uh, attack. Slow them down. We've got cavalry on the way. How long are they going to take? Ah, way too long, it looks like. I think this might be a lost cause. Again, they keep putting the units in here. I guess we'll at least get the land, right? There we go. Right. We can modify government. I don't think we want any of this, really. Naval speed. Decisive battle. Yes, we'll grab you. Over here, we're holding. Nothing happening here. Here is still a mess. Here is unfortunate. If they grab the oil fields, we're in trouble. I might send reinforcements down there. Yeah. Can't let them capture the oil fields. If they do that, that's our oil supply gone as well as the Soviet Union's. Okay, keep pushing forwards, guys. Don't worry, I won't stop you. You're claiming your homeland in India. That's that's not my job, you know. Um, I'm pro-Indian holding their own country ness. Oh, hello. Uh, what? Who doesn't have a job over here anymore? You. Okay, um. Also, your color is way too close to someone else's. So you have to be hot pink. That's the rule. Someone else is hot pink. You could be more of a, like a bluish purple. And your pink can be hotter. And you can stop being like a vague, crappy pink. Just be like a really just crappy color. 
There we go. Oh, hello. We have issues over here. What's the problem now? Can't get any more steel from you. Uh, is there anyone nearby we can get steel from? Like, maybe Turkey? That's pushing it. Yeah, this attack on us is a bit of a failure, which is good. Again, that means more units just getting smushed. How's the construction going? I'm going to add some coastal forts everywhere where they've got a, uh, a port. Which I can't really see. Oh, I can't really see. There we go. Wait, not you. Ah, well, you can have some too. And that all seems good to me. There we go. I don't know why this didn't show up. Regardless, it doesn't matter. This is quite a lax naval invasion, all things considered. Mainly because they're running out of supplies, I think. Meanwhile, over here, just gonna order an all-out attack there. Just keep holding on to Odessa. We can't really let them have that as well. We're holding the line, which is which is all we really need to do. The issue is if the United States joins in, that's a big buff to the Allies, and I don't really want that to happen. Um. How's it going over here? You're making headway. Just keep going. You can do it. I believe in you. Uh, I wonder if I can ask you to turn over land. Ask for control of state. I'll send it. They'll say no. But that's their fault. You know, whatever comes to them now, if they can't deal with their own, like, stuff, we're not going to deal with it for them. You know? They've got to learn. We could do an assault over here, but they've got quite a few forces. Where is the port here? Here, here, okay. Those are the only two, no, and here. So they've got three ports. If we can hit those ports, all the troops here suddenly are reduced in supply and ability to fight back, and eventually we'll just get cut off and then crushed. I think that has to be our long-term goal for that front. But the front needs to move because it's been stale for way too long. Now, in the background, I have been training some extra units. Got the heavy crew of the three. Thank you very much. We'll get to that in a minute. I'm just going to leave it as one extra lot of 24 for now. Um, yeah, I think we're going to go heavy crews of four as well. 
How are we doing with Cruiser? Did we done the 20th of October? Okay. I don't want to lose the production time we put in so far. I think if we're lucky, we can get Harbin. Get this as well. Half of you need a distraction up here. Now, they are having supply issues. You can see they're really having a lot of 70% uh, attrition, etc, 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 blah, blah, blah. It's all going great for us. Come on, get the units in position. There we go. Right, hit them here. Someone go distract this guy. And you go through to Harbin. I think that's it. Okay, start destroying them. Did I jump the gun there? They're moving back. Oh, I, make, I think I jumped the gun. 12 hours, 10, 9, 6, 5. Oh, we did it just. Jump that gun a bit too fast. Rubber. There's no one to really provide me with rubber with. Yeah, that's why we need to get through Siam. Or at least ignore Sam. We can go around. There we go. Nice overrun. At some point, we'll also like secure this flank because that's awfully close to getting through and hitting us. Like that's what two provinces. I don't want to be responsible for that. Uh, over here, all is good. The center's buckled. I think we'll keep the assault on the center going a little bit longer. Hell, I think we'll actually turn that into a push. Meantime, hi United Kingdom. The goal is just to get units in their way, slow them down. Use up all of their supplies that we can. Submarine three. We'll wait until it's done. Second of October and twentieth of October is what we're waiting for. And in terms of tech, we'll grab destroyer or. Why are you leaving this undefended? Mate, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, mate. We've talked about this. There we go. They're a little bit hurt. They're moving their forces in, but they should be fine. I'm going to keep an eye on this because the red of Britain is going to be very confusing. Yes, France, take your continent back. Indochina is all of yours. You own that continent. Definitely take it back. I support your choices. Please make good choices. 
How many X units do we get? Eight. Um, immediately put you on this section, because we always get hit here. And I know they're not veteran or anything, but gonna have to cope with that. At some point, we should make a reserve force. Um, but for now, that's fine. Okay, how do we do over here? You're done? Okay. Since you're kind of done and on your way back, would you mind awfully just finishing this off? Let's upgrade the sub time. And then cruises in another 10 days. Yeah, keep spreading out like that. It's going to work out great for you. Uh, that better be a temporary bug. Okay, they are pushing here. Looks like we struck back against them just to slow them down. I might actually need to bring some forces over. That's a bit strong. Which is all the better, because when we crush them, that's all gone. Mate, you've got the wrong idea about this attack, but sure. We'll force our way in here. These are a couple of weak points we can exploit. Meanwhile, keep close eye on this, because this is going to be dangerous. Ah, it looks like they're out of resources. You can tell because they're attacks, they're attacking and stopping instantly. Come on, keep pushing around. You're doing so well. I believe in you. And just we're going against the am, which is going to take a while, actually. But we need to do that so that we can then declare war on them and go through them. But if we declare war on them, they join the battle on the Allies' side. Their forces will go into the Allied territory, push back the Soviet Union, who aren't expecting it. And then we get to attack them back. We're horrible people. Uh, I think we'll just go for extra infantry equipment right now. Because that's one of our limits on training more people. Did the Soviet Union close off its supplies to everybody? You did, you absolute ass. I needed those supplies. Oh, man. That is the biggest... I mean, I've been a... Not a particularly good friend to them. But this just means I'm gonna... I'm gonna make it worse. Like, look how much stuff I need to now import. No one has this much. Oh, damn it. Uh, 
I need... I need the rubber down here. Soviet Union, you're absolute ass. Such an ass. Ah, uh, the heavy cruiser is not going to be completed. I need them to push onwards quickly. Did they take a port? They took a port. Everybody take the port back now. Okay, we got the port. The Brit. No, bad Brit. Go away. Let's take our 22 subs. Uh, uh, new commander. There we go. So good that we don't have any commanders. And you just think we got some when we absorbed the, uh, the Chinese, but... Automatic split off is enabled. Go back when medium hurt. And I want you to convoy raid. You'll probably be intercepted and murdered. There. You killed a destroyer. Okay, next level naval bomber. We want them naval bombers. Uh, oh dear. Defend that at all costs. You come back. You come over here as well. If they get that, they'll resupply. If they don't get that, this attack will blunt their attack. There we go, like that. That's going perfectly. Uh, victory? Cool. And they're losing some destroyers. I'm assuming they're like elderly destroyers that they just left behind. To guard against us. We're losing loads of merchant shipping. Absolutely loads of it. Uh, I would say tons, but that would be belying the size of the issue. Soviet Union has actually killed our military production in one fell swoop. Like, seriously. We've got one heavy cruiser and nine destroyers to our name. Crush those forces. The issue of playing for time is we're waiting for that time when 
you know, they don't need people left, but they've got the United States coming for them. So, oh, hello. This is actually quite a lot of forces we're going to be killing off. Damn. Uh, we'll go for level three on you. Also, we are in 96 at 46 headed for 47, and we haven't researched jet engines. Which is unusual for me. Where are they headed for? There's no ports up here. It's an odd tactical decision. Excellent, you're walking. Thank you. Uh, we did lose a sub. Oh, convoys again. So many convoys. We're losing huge amounts. Huge amounts of convoys. And I just need the allies to push here. If you have an inefficient stockpile, deal with it yourself. What will you give me? That won't give me anything. I could give them something, but I don't trust them with them. Uh, how's the assault going? Making headway. Let's hit the capital. These bunkers here we can deal with later. Hold those units in place. And now we're going to try and meet up here. It's gonna work. If we can, though, we'd surround 14 units, which is a pretty good haul. Uh, you're gonna need to attack them to keep them in place. I don't think you're gonna be able to hold them long enough. Oh. Oh, 97, 98, 98. Whoa. Yes, did it. Okay. That's surrounded. I think it's 12 units in the end. And we'll want to keep this push on up here because this is a port, which is going to be great for cutting off their supply lines. And yes, it did originally begun to Russia, so it is going to belong to them now when we take it back because we're friends with them. Hello, hello, hello. Why is that one frontier just stretched so... There we go. Right, how are we doing defending up here? Great. 
Uh, okay, everything is within normal parameters. They still haven't pushed very far. In fact, I think they've lost ground, if anything. Um, our yellow over here needs to be given some space, so we'll give that. And we are still in a severe resource shortage. I mean, severe. Like, really, really bad. Mainly submarines, so we will bring... I think we'll bring the fleet out. I think we have to split it into two. Create new fleet. All carriers. Select the other fleet. Oh, Admiral Yi. Did we lose all the subs? We might have lost all the subs. And put you on convoy escort. Automatic split off. Medium priority repair. Just here. Oh god, they're bringing in battleships. Uh, this might be the death of this group! Run away! Run away and go home! Run away and go home! Do it now! Bring a revolution to Siam. Yes! In the revolution. How long till I mow ago? 3rd of April? At that point, they'll burst out, attacking the Soviet Union from behind. Soviet Union will crumble here. We can then take the land. That should give us our resources, and then we can take British Raj for the steel. That should solve our resource issues. But for now, we're stuck with horrible resource issues, because Soviet Union stabbed us in the back. It won't solve our oil issue, though. So we might actually want to just accelerate production of our other oil infrastructure. Okay. For now, though, I've been Edward. If you like, like, you know, subscribe, please consider subscribing. But until next time, where well, this war will continue, stay shiny.